welcome to another Top 5 Wednesday video. This week's theme is Top 5 Friendships. So let's get started. Number 5 for me are Jean and Locke from The Lies of Locke Lamoura. Actually, it's more accurate to say that I love the entire Gentleman Bastards group and the friendships that have formed between them, even though at first maybe they didn't like each other, but that necessity and just mutual survival have brought them close enough together that an actual friendship has formed and now they're inseparable and they really would do anything for each other, even die for each other and I think that's amazing. The Lies of Locke Lamour doesn't have a love story and so that's kind of like my ship. You know, like a friendship ship in the book that I just love reading about and love hearing details about and yeah, I just really adore them. Number four would have to be Paige and Nick from The Bone Season. I just love the kind of brotherly, sisterly love that they have despite the fact that Paige would like it to be more and yeah, I just kind of really adore them together and I think Nick is such an awesome person like if he would, could possibly become my best friend, I'd totally take him like in a heartbeat. Number three are Celia and Lo from Fathomless. I just love that despite the fact they're both vying for the same boy, they're willing to put the other person's needs and wants before their own and they really just want the other person to be happy and I think that's what really makes a good friendship. I think it's just awesome that the friendship is put to the test and it still stands strong and yeah, I love them together so much, like wow, love them. On place number two, we have the friendship that is probably on every single video today. And it is James and Will from the Infernal Devices. Their relationship is kind of in a similar situation as Celia and Lowe's because they both want the same girl and obviously only one of them can have her. I've always said that I love the love triangle in the Infernal Devices because it's really a proper love triangle. Like everybody in this love triangle loves everybody else. And James and Will, they love each other so much. They are just willing to give absolutely everything, every shred of their own happiness for the other person. And it is just really heartwarming to read about that. And I think everyone really can consider themselves lucky if they even have half a good a friendship as James and Will do. And the winners of today's Top 5 Wednesday are Holmes and Watson from Sherlock Holmes, which I'm betting is another very popular pick today. <laughs> they just have like friendship chemistry, you know? They're both kind of willing to put up with the other person's antics and despite the fact that they're so incredibly different, they still find common ground and they still really, really love each other. And I think, oh my God, I love their friendship. I know a lot of people like ship them together. I don't, I don't see the point in shipping anything that like remotely likes each other, but I do think that they have a beautiful friendship and ah, oh, I love it so much. I especially love the friendship in the movies because Jude Law and Robert Downey Jr. just have such chemistry. It's awesome. Oh my gosh, I love them so much. Okay, you guys, so that's it for this week's Top 5 Wednesday. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to like and subscribe and go check out all the other booktubers in the description bar below. They'll all have a similar video up today so you can see everybody else's Top 5 Friendships as well. Have a lovely week, you guys. I'm gonna see you soon. Bye!